what is going on you guys and welcome back to another video so today guys we're rebuilding the cleveland indians um this is a team that sadly traded away one of at least their second best player on their team and francisco lindor which i'm excited because he came to my favorite team the new york mets which is awesome to hear but we're gonna hop into it um i will see you guys at the end of the season so unfortunately we finished 82 and 80 and couldn't make it to the playoffs so um let's take a look we finished third place which is realistically where they would finish off in real life um it looks like jose ramirez went off i'm glad to see that um one silver slugger as well so the rotation shane bieber he had himself a good season as well as zach plesak um aaron as well did good Trinston could have done better. Um, Logan Allen, he did pretty good. It's awesome to see that as a number five. Um, bullpen wasn't that bad. It also wasn't the best either. Um, we only had three people that did pretty well, which is not good to see. Offense, Rosario, he didn't do that good. Um, Cesar did all right. Jose, the best. Reyes, awesome. Uh, Josh Naylor could have done better, especially as a DH. Um, Eddie Rosario did good, as well as Bobby. Uh, that's horrible. Um, could have been better. Um, same thing. The bench is not the best. So, I'm noticing with this team, it's lack of offense. Um, as you guys see, they're 28th and contact and then 20th and power so offense is what seems like is a power on this team or a problem because pitching they're ranked 11th and they do got a pretty good rotation so you know they are known for pitching so it's you know not surprising astros defeat the cubs that's strange all right we got three people that retired all right, so let's take a look here um, because we got a lot of a couple people we got to extend. Um, let's take a look first because we got a couple options. Our highest played dude, this is ridiculous, dude. Our highest paid player is Jose Ramirez, and he's the only one. Then after that, we're literally look at the team revenue, dude. Oh my god, this is horrible. Um, but it's not surprising. It's something that the Indians do anyways. So, um, I don't know. I'm not too happy with those numbers at all. Um, Logan Allen, he did do pretty well. I think he could stay. I think we move, uh, Tristan McKenzie. We'll call him McKenzie, whatever. I think we'll move him to the bullpen. And then Kyle, I think, will stay. Um, we'll have to see. So, extending. This is where I want to look at. We got Eddie Rosario. Um, our outfield is not the best. It's never been the best for them. Um, all right. So, we don't have the best options. Um, Jordan, he looks like he's pretty promising. Um, who's our DH? Cause it should be Reyes. Our defense is not good. That's for sure in the outfield. Um, and Rosario, he has all right defense for a left fielder. I think, uh, <clears throat> I think we'll bring him back. I think what we could do is work out a one-year deal and see how he does for $15 million. See how he does. Cesar, I don't think so. Um, I'm not going to bring him back. Roberto Perez, he did do pretty good, but I'm also not going to bring back. Uh, Blake Parker. No, thank you. He's not coming back either. And then nobody. So, 
see you guys at the beginning of the free agency guys right, so um with this team so pitching side of things we're gonna move tristan into the rotation or bullpen like i said um i think we're gonna put emmanuel Classe as a setup man uh also nick i don't know why they moved him um i think we'll move tristan to a middle or mckenzie to a middle reliever so that leave us with one, two, three, four, five, six. So we only need one more guy. Um, actually, I think we'll put Class A. So we'll just need like a setup man, whatever, and then like a number five starter. Um, and we should be solid with that pitching side of things. Now, offense. So I want you guys to check me out. I'm not bringing back Rosario. I, I didn't offer him a... a arbitration i'm not gonna bring him back he's just those numbers are not good and he's been playing way too long for it to be that bad um so we are gonna need a shortstop um i know about jimenez but i think i'm gonna work something out with him uh because we do also need a second baseman which is what i think where he's gonna go um especially that his defense is not the best and then i do want to work on the outfield because I'm kind of not too satisfied, especially defense. Um, first base is fine. Um, center field and right field. Josh is g We got Rosario in left. Now, the thing is, Josh, we'd have in right. Problem is, is that his defense is not that good. Um, and I do want to improve on defense. I want Reyes to be our DH, like our lockdown DH. Um and then you know work from there but you know something's going on so third base is locked down down left field first and catcher i'm not bringing back any other catchers um so literally the only position we got that's locked down is first dh and third so we do got to do some trading here um i want to check really with outfield um, I would like to get, I know I have a lot of prospects in the outfield, but they're still developing. Um, and I want to, I want to at least put somebody in right field. Um, I like Jordan. He's definitely good. I think he'll be our right fielder. I think Josh is going to be the one that's going to head out. Um, so Jordan will be our right fielder. Um, and then uh, Jordan, 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 you're in right field. Awesome. You're in right field there. All right. So Jordan will be our right fielder. Um, left field is going to be Rosario. So really, we got to work on center field. Um, see what we can find, you know, with that. So let's check here. So we need a starter. Let's look at starters first. So we got a couple options. We got Drew um, Smiley, who doesn't look like that good uh charlie morton dang i'm surprised normally this off season with pitching is freaking loaded but i think everybody got a contract that are like the big time pitchers yeah the mats everybody gave uh free agency so we just need like a number five anyways it doesn't matter um We got to look, we got a couple options like Martin Perez. He did pretty well. Um, do we need another lefty? We could use another lefty, maybe. Uh, we got Charlie Morton, who's starting to decline quick. Also, Max Scherzer. Um, we also got John Gray. Now, we could bring somebody up. That's the thing. Like a Tanner, maybe. Um... We got to see here. Um, Drew, he did not that good. <sighs> Let's see. Michael, how did Michael do? He did horrible. Christ. Let's check Jordan. Daniel. All right. So we got, we got definitely a lot of searching. Then we need a setup man. I like Corey. Or Dan, they've won a lot though. That's probably gonna be the thing. Um, 
Joe Kelly could maybe be used as a setup man. Um, we don't need a closer. We got that. Um, yeah, we don't need a closer. We got Brad Hand out there again. We do need a catcher. But I don't think it's worth that much to go out and get like a Salvador Perez. Um, we'll have to look. We also do need a sword stop. And let's see. We could bring back Francisco Lindor. He's, even though it's going to be a lot of money he's going to want. Um, let me see what, how, like, I don't know. I'm going to have to see here. Let's set, check center field. Oh, we got Michael Conforto. Let's see center field. So we do got a couple options like Starling Marte, uh, Danella DeShields Jr. Um, Jackie Bradley Jr. Um, we got a couple options, even Ender and Ziarte. All right, well, um, I'm going to make a couple signings, and I will see you guys at the beginning of the season. We got a trade here with the Dodgers. Um, we are in the beginning of the season. I haven't simmed through it yet, but we have a trade with the Dodgers here. Like I told you guys, we did need a center fielder. Now, we're going to make this move. Um, really, money is going to be good for both teams um, and all that, but we're giving away... A shortstop prospect, which we don't have to worry about. You guys will see in a minute. We are giving away Eddie Rosario just because of the money. And then we're giving a short uh, center fielder prospect for Cody Bellinger and Chris Taylor. Um, Chris will be our center and then Cody will be our center fielder. So that's how it's going to go. So um, let me fix it up and then I'll be back. And All right. So um, with the pitching side of things first. So we signed Charlie Morton. To a one-year five million, he's gonna be our number four starter. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we're missing one reliever. Hold on a minute, guys. Um. I'm confused. We're missing a reliever. Um, but yeah, so uh, we signed Charlie Morton to a one-year deal. I'll f fix that in a minute for five million. Then we also signed Corey for one year, 6.8. He's going to be a setup man. Um, offense. This is where it is. So, Andre Jimenez, we brought him up. He's going to be our second baseman. Taylor, you guys know, will be our left, which is good because he's a pretty good defender. Um, Naylor, we're staying right. It's supposed to be Jordan. I don't know why they keep doing that. Right field. That's fine. Uh... All right. Um, but, yeah, so Jordan will be our right fielder. Um, Cody Bellinger in center. Uh, Marcus Simeon, we signed him to a two-year, $22 million contract to be our shortstop. And then we signed Jan Gomes to a one-year 4.4. He will be our catcher. So that's how we're going to roll. I think we're probably ranked better now than what we were. Well, we're ranked 21st now. Our pitching is not good. Our speed is better. Our power is better and contact, but our defense is atrocious, which I'm not happy to see. Um, we're going to see how it plays out. Um, I think the pitching side of things should be good. Um, let me see what reliever could we sign potentially. There is a couple good ones. Righty, righty. Let's see what we need first. We're going to need a lefty. God, Lord. Mark, lefty, I know. Adam Arovino. We might have to go with Oliver again. Bring him back on a one-year deal. I guess we'll do that. Because we do need a lefty. So, we're going to roll like that. I'll see you guys at the All-Star break. All right, guys. So, we're currently 56 and 40. We're in second place. Ranked 19th in all of baseball still. Pitching side of things, Bieber, oh my, what the world, he is not doing that good, um, Zach is doing great, Aaron is doing great, Morton as well, and Logan, 
Uh, bullpen, McKenzie's doing good. Kyle, bullpen is not bad, except for Klaus and Perez. Corey isn't doing good either. Nick is doing solid. James is doing pretty good. Um, lineup, Jimenez is doing pretty solid. I like that average. His on-base percentage is good. I like that. Chris Taylor's doing good. Jose Ramirez as well. Reyes is doing good. Um, Jordan could be doing better. Cody Bellinger. Damn, Cody, that average. Um, uh, Marcus Simeon's doing pretty well. Bobby could be doing better. And then Jan Gomes is doing pretty good as a catcher. Bench is doing bench things. It's not bad. I'm really shocked. So I'm really just, I'm really, what really has me like, dang, is the st our ace, Mr. Um, Shane Bieber. He's not doing the best at all. Um, so let's take a look at the trading block here. We got a couple options. We got Michael Brantley, who did pretty well. Josh Donaldson is doing good, which is really surprising. Anthony's doing solid. Current Frazier is doing good. Uh, we got a couple good options. We'll be honest. We got a couple good options. Um, let's see. What could we get for an ace type role? Um, Uh, let's think here. I need to get like an ace who I know will do good. Um, Maeda always, always does good. That dude is always on point. Um, Dylan Bundy, he's not doing that good. Andrew isn't doing good either. Um, Mike Soroka is doing good. Maybe we could do that. Mike Soroka for Shane Bieber. Save up a lot of money. And we still have him locked up for a long time. I think we're going to do that. We'll do that trade. Who I do like. He's definitely going to be a good ace for the Braves long term he's only 23 too that's the crazy part of it so um we do need a better setup man because Corey isn't doing the best at all um how's crochet doing could go with Matt we could do Matt and then give away Oliver Perez as well. And get like a, a Zach Britton back. To replace the lefty. I think we'll do that trade. Because Matt. Or then we could put Zach Britton as a setup man. And then we could put Matt as a middle reliever. Yeah, we're going to do that. Um... So that pitching side of things should boost up, definitely. Um, hopefully it continues doing well. Now the offense. So I'm fine with second base, left field, third, DH. Right field is where I'm iffy, but I'm going to keep it like that. Center field is where it's like, okay, what's going on? Cody Bellinger, he's, he's not doing the best at all. His stats, he's going down. And... I don't know really. Marcus Simeon, shortstop is fine. First base is where it's like, okay, what's going on really? Um, I think I might do a shipment with center field and first, maybe. Um, let's see what we can find center field that's good and first base. I'm thinking let's check out the Mets. They got Michael Taylor. That is horrible. How's my Brandon Nemo? He's not doing that good.
Because if we want a first baseman, we could just go like a Dominic Smith, who isn't doing good either. You know what? Let's check out the Twins. Let's see what they got. Uh, wait, let's check the Dodgers first. See how the players we gave them are doing. Mm, not that big of a difference. We could go a Mookie Betts route. No, because that contract that he got is not good. Even though he deserves it, though, that's for sure. I'm going to give him that. He definitely deserves that contract. Um, Trent Grisham looks pretty well. Um, Profar is looking well as well. Um, let me take a look. How's Mike doing? Let's go to the Twins again. Uh, let's take a look. Oh, they got Yoki Cespedes now. Let's see how Byron Buxton's doing. Not bad, not bad. Only thing is, is that contract he's going to want after the season's over. Damn, they got Chris Bryant too. Dang, I see you, Twins. Mike Trout. <laughs> Wouldn't mind him, but contract that they he got is not good um uh let's see because i'm really just focused center field um christian pache maybe he hasn't played at all uh victor ian hap how's he doing He's doing pretty well, and he got another year of arbitration. Defense is what kills it, though. Um, Kyle Lewis. He hasn't gotten that much playing time because they got George Springer. I don't know why they got him for. I'm really interested in um, the Cubs, Ian Happ, and then a first baseman. That's the problem, though. Um, uh, let's think here. Do we just keep Cody and then try to get a first baseman? Because he's... He, this first baseman we got is not good. Could go Muncy here. Um, how is this guy doing? No, wait. Was it the Brewers or him? This guy looks pretty good. All oh, that average. This guy looks pretty promising. Um, this is difficult. I it really is. Reese Hoskins looks pretty good. How about Pete Alonso? His average is horrible though. Maybe Jesus. Maybe Jesus. I think we go Jesus here. Defense is good, too. I say we go Jesus and just... Oh. Yeah, I say we go Jesus here. And then... um, Especially his contract's cheap. So we go Jesus and then, you know, continue on from there. He is doing pretty well, though. I got to give it to him. Our defense is not the best, though. But it's fine. Well... We're going to keep it like that. I'll see you guys at the end of the season. All right, so um, we finish off 98 and 64. We're taking on the White Sox in the wild card. Um, so this team pretty, finished pretty good. Um, ranked 18th, 18th in all of baseball. Soroka looks like he went off. Um, Jimenez won Rookie of the Year, which I'm glad to see. Soroka did phenomenal. Zag did phenomenal. Aaron as well. Charlie as well. Logan. 
the bullpen. Alec Mills, we did get him in a trade that I'll explain more in a minute. Um, everybody pitching side of things did great. I'm glad to see. Offense. Menes, great. Awesome. 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 So, um, before we continue, I did trade Cody Bellinger for Ian Happ and Alec Mills. Um, reasoning is because Cody Bellinger was about to be a free agent, and I was like, might as well get something worth out of him, and you know, this is what it was. Um, we still got this guy for one more year because he got arbitration. So, you know, and he did way better, hopefully, I think. Uh, let's check. Yeah, he did way better. So it's like not a big of a loss. Um, and then um, Jose, Jesus Aguilar, he did pretty well. I'm glad to see. Uh, Marcus Simeon as well. Jan Gomes did good. And then our right fielder was all right. Um, bench was bench, obvious. So let's get into this. We got Soroka versus Lucas Giolito. All right. Um, let's go Soroka. All right. Oh, no. Come on, Soroka. Buddy. Buddy, you were doing good, bro. Oh, man. I'm just going to do this. I'm not even going to bother. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude. We got our tails whooped by the White Sox. God damn. Uh, Marlins defeat the Twins. Damn, dude. Like, what's the odds? Retired players. Morton retired. Perfect. Um, now we could throw Alec Mills in. Um, which was the main reason why I got him. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Um, so let's bring back up Emmanuel Classe. To be our number seven reliever. So, let's check the offense. Or, let's check what we need. Oh, my God. We need a bunch of stuff. We need a new manager, all that. I'll handle that. So, we got Zach Britton, who did phenomenal, as always. I think we could bring him back on a one-year deal. Uh, we could do f five million. Uh, Nick, I think we'll also bring back. He did pretty well. One year deal though. I'm not going to go higher than that. I think we'll go 4.5. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to do the same for, um, Zach Britton. Jan Gomes, I think we're also going to bring back. He did do pretty good. 4.5. And then Jesus Aguilar, we're also going to bring back 4.5. So, we're going to go like that. I'll see you guys at the beginning of free agency. Hey, right, guys. So, um, the pitching side of things, I think, is fine. Uh, we got everybody. Everybody's going to stay put. We got one through seven. So, pitching side of things, it's fine. Um, where I need to work on is offense. So, second base is fine. Left field, third, DH, center, first base, shortstop catcher so it's literally just right field literally right field is what we got to work on um i kind of want to be precautious though because i know like jose ramirez he's about to be a free agent also simeon we do got a couple people that are gonna have to head out um so i'm gonna have to think about it through see how i can do this um we got to see, though, which shortstops we got that could be available. How big is his contract, though? He's making $80 million. No. Yeah, $80 million. And that would probably mess up our... Yeah. Unless we were to, like, do something crazy. Yeah. Um... I don't know. Glaber would be nice, but he's, uh, actually let's do our trick. I forgot about it. 
Uh, Tati, she's going to be way too much. Uh, we all know that one. Trey Turner. He did pretty well. Let's go make a trade for Glaber Torres. Oh, uh, yeah. They want a lot more for that. That's ridiculous. That's too much. How did Bachette do? Let's try Bachette. Bo, 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 Bo. Where are you at, Bo? Um, and we'd have him way longer, too. Damn it, dude. Uh, he didn't do that good. How about Jorge? Um, Xavier Edwards. Um, is is that Simeon? His thing's not that high. It's trade value. Um, we'll work it out. We'll work it out. Let Let's see. All right, let's check free agency. So, um. We do got to look at right field, which we do got a couple good players. We got Aaron Judge, who did all right. He's not didn't do the best. Um, we also got Joey Gallo, who didn't do the best either. Will Myers was the best one. Um, Adam Duvall didn't do that good. Adam Eaton could have been better. Um. Let's see here. Because if anything, we could just... Who's our center fielder? Ian Happ? Uh, let's see here. We do got a couple options. We do. Well, I'm going to make a couple signings. Probably just one or two. And I'll see you guys at the beginning of the season. All right, so let's get started. So the rotation, bullpen, everything's still the same. Nothing's changed. This is where it's changed. So, we went out and we signed Aaron Judge. We gave him a five-year, $145 million contract. Uh, he will be our right fielder. We also signed Didi Gregorius to one year, $5.0 million. Um, he will be our shortstop. And we're going to run like this. Hopefully, things don't go down south, uh, to put it like that. Um Let's make sure that everything's right. Uh, let's do that. All right. Um, that's fine with me. All right. Well, I'll see you guys at the All-Star break. Guys, so we're currently 66 and 30. We're in first place, ranked 14th in all of baseball. So, oh my god, Soroka doing great, Zach doing good, Aaron doing good, Alec doing good, Logan could be doing better. Bullpen is solid, everybody's doing good, I'm glad to see. Offense, Jimenez good, awesome, awesome. Judge, what happened, dude? Ian Hap, good, 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 good. Judge, like, what the heck? I'm trying to see. All right. Well, we do need a new catcher. Um, right field is not in the best positions right now. Um, let me think here. What do I do? I need to go out and get a good time right fielder. Um, Hunter Renfro. How's he not doing good? Austin Meadows. That wouldn't be bad. And then get a catcher and Travis Darno. You know what? I say we do this trade. Ah, oh, man, I can't. It's too big of a contract. How about Max? He normally does pretty good. Cespedes, looking good. Otani. 
Ooh. Do we go trout here? I say we go trout here. Should we? We could get him. Nah. I'm sorry. It's just too... Mm -mm. How about Gallo? No. Acuna, maybe? Uh, JJ normally does pretty good. How about Juan Soto? Um, Harper. I wouldn't mind Harper. Christian Yelich. Christian Yelich. We'll come back to that. I think we go... We make a move for Christian Yelich. I say we do that. Yeah. Christian Yelich. I say we do that. And then let's see what we can get for catcher. Which is going to be the difficult part. Um, how about Joey? Adley Rushman. Um, Wilson Contreras. I want to go Travis Darno. Without trading anybody that's good. All right, we'll do that. We will do that. Um, so then let's put Travis Darno as our catcher. Christian Yelich and right. This team's loaded. That's all I'm going to say. It is loaded. It is going to be disgusting. Um... Because we did get a, a nice catcher, and we did get a right fielder who's good. Um, which definitely should bring us up in rankings 10th now. Well, I'll see you guys at the end of the season. Guys, we finished 112 and 50. We'll be taking on either the Astros or the Yankees. Uh, looks like Zach went off. We finished first place, 11th in all the baseball. Zach won to Cy Young. Awesome to see. Soroka did good. Zach, awesome. Aaron, good. Alec Mills could have done better. Logan did good. Bullpen, Emmanuel Clase and Zach Britton didn't do the best. Offense, Jimenez, good. Taylor, good. Awesome. Phenomenal. Good. Awesome. Good. Good. And then good. That's good to see. Our lineup was good. Let's see how did Judge do. Oh, uh, it's all right. It's nothing good. All right. Well, let's hop in here. Take it on the Yankees. Soroka versus Cole. Won that. Zach versus Keller. Lost that one. What the hell? Who did so bad? Zach. Aaron versus who knows who. Won that. Alex versus James. Won that one. All right. We got Logan versus Brandon. Won that. Soroka versus Griffin. Lost that. Zach Brenton. Zach versus Andrew. Lost that one. What? Aaron versus Dylan Bundy. Oh, my. No way. All right. Hell no. Hold on. We can't put Alec Mills to start. Crazy. Hell no, dude. Um, I don't know if we go Alec Mills here. Let's play ball. Oh, and we're not scoring not one run either. Ball four, take your base. All right. Damn it, dude. Why are you doing so bad? Three. Three. Ball four, take your base. All right. We're not going to waste any time.
Dude, oh my god. I should have known that was Anthony. Alright, we gotta go in here. What the hell, bruh? How are the Angels seeming to always do good, dude? This makes no sense. We got a way better roster than the Angels. Oh, my God. And then we'd be t the winner would take on the Padres, but we still need to win f three more games in order to win or make it because our rotation isn't good enough. Oh, that's caught. More season, it's just Ramirez. Oh, Lord. All right, we'll give him that. Britain, we're going to let walk. I think Nick will bring back on a five-year deal, a one-year deal, six million. Darno will bring back definitely on one-year deal. I think we go 10. Uh, Jesus will bring back also on a one-year deal, 1 1.5. 5. Shortstop, I'm going to let go. So I'll see you guys at the beginning of free agency. It's going to stay put. I'm not going to move anybody at all. Bullpen is where it's going to be iffy. So Class A is leaving. Um, so we're going to need two relievers. Offense, we are going to need a shortstop. So let's take a look at what we can find maybe. All right. Um, let's see. What we got? Oh, Cody Bellinger now. Now he did good. He did all right. All right. So, um, let's see here. Oh, Luis Castillo. Body really from starters wise. Um, we got what we got. We do need a reliever, though. We do got a couple options. Jose didn't do that good. Jonathan did pretty well. Alex Reyes didn't do good. Pedro Baez, he does pretty good. All right. Um, let's check here. We don't need any closers. We do need a shortstop. How did Rosario do? Yeah, wasn't worth it. Marcus Simeon did pretty well. We don't got that much good options here. Might just have to go DD another year um what else was it that we needed just shortstop right yeah shortstop and then two relievers so um i'm gonna do a couple signings i guess and i'll see you guys at the beginning of the season all right guys so um we're gonna make this quick so we signed kenta maeda two-year deal we just went for pitching alec mills we let him go we also signed uh, Pedro Baez to a one-year deal, $5.1 million to replace Emmanuel Classe. We also signed Trevor May for $5 million. He will replace um, whoever it was. I forgot. And then lineup, we brought back Chris uh, Didi for one year, 4.5. And then we signed um, also... That was it, really, actually, for offense. So... We're going to run like that. See you guys at the end of the season. All right, guys. So we finished 106 and 56. We're taking on the winner of the wild card. So we didn't make trades. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not right. So we got Corbin Burns, who we traded. Um, forgot who it was. He did well, though, as well as Sandy. Bullpen was not bad, um, except for Trevor May and Nick and James. Rotation was awesome. Lineup, everybody did well, except for Jimenez. Wasn't the best season. Finished first place, ranked ninth in all of baseball. Looks like Yelich went off. Um, Yeah, so top in. All right, we got Detroit. We got Soroka versus Mize, won that. Kenta Maeda lost that one. Zach Corbin, what the hell? All right, Tampa. All right. Game one, game two, game three, game four, game five. We won the World Series. So, all right. Um, sorry I was like in a rush thing. It's just I wanted to, I really wanted to just like end things, whatever. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, give it a like, subscribe.